My name is Trudy Jacobs. Um, I'm at the University of Iowa in their Doctor of Audiology program. Um, we have a series of outplacement rotations where we go all over the state of Iowa um, to be supervised um, and gain some clinical experience. So right now I'm at Great Prairie AEA with Alyssa. I knew I wanted to do healthcare and I kind of Google search came across audiology, um, which is really a great blend of, of healthcare, math, science, um, but also just a, a sense of advocating for your patients is a big thing within this field specifically, making sure that all of our all of our patients have access to, to language and whatever works best for their model. So I'm Holly Forster and I'm an occupational therapy student from the University of South Dakota. Some people are like, what is occupational therapy? And I think Kristen and the other OTs have obviously done a fantastic job for advocating for the profession and everyone else can see how it helps the kids as well. So. We can assist in speech and PT and just incorporating different things because um, even working with speech with a kid with a assistive tech device like that might have physical limitations on hitting buttons, like how to collaborate with them. One thing I have noticed since being here is all the collaboration that all the disciplines do with the teachers and just giving them advice. Like when I was in elementary school, I remember kids would leave and go to speech, but I didn't even know who the speech therapist was. Like I couldn't have picked them out if they walked in. And so just them giving advice to the teachers to help those kids, but all the kids. So to just see and feel the support in a classroom available to a student and to be a part of that support system has been a big aha moment. One of the big things is you get to see um, the interdisciplinary approach and you get to work so closely with other staff. And it's not just like being in an outpatient setting where it's like, maybe it's just the OT, maybe you also have the PT, but you also get to collaborate with them. So you can say, how is this kid doing with you? Like maybe the speech therapist says, they didn't have a great day with me. So you can know what to expect and maybe how that kid's gonna come into the session. And so it's nice to have those other people to talk to, I think. I've learned so much about the school system, but also how to be good at this job. Um, I've, I've learned so much about how to be personable and connect with, with her students and with her families that she works with. Um, and she's been a phenomenal role model to work under. One thing that really stands out to me is just seeing the kids, maybe not even when they're at OT, interacting with Kristen and just the other staff from the AEA and how they like light up. And it's the cool thing to go to OT and they want to go. And a lot of them want to participate in just seeing the confidence that they get when they do really well in OT is also really cool. When they're like, hey, I did a good job. And it's like, yeah, you really did do a good job. I'm excited to finally be in a position where I have the skill set, the knowledge base to make a difference in someone's education and make a difference in someone's life. Um, right now we're learning and I'm always going to continue to be learning. Um, but eventually I'll be in a place where I can actually do the thing, right? I can actually make a difference. Every child. Every classroom. Every day. We are GPAEA.